was another beautiful day in the quiet town of Marketville until tragedy struck. Well, you better be here to tell me I won the lottery or that somebody's dead. Somebody will be, and it's you. I am live on scene where a newspaper was just brutally murdered here behind me. I'm here with Detective Herring. Detective, what can you tell us about this? We don't really know what happened exactly, but we're going to investigate this thoroughly. Do you believe this was an isolated incident, or should the community be worried that there's a serial killer on the loose? I believe it was very isolated, and we're going to find them, and this is not going to happen again. Well, you heard it here first, folks. There's nothing to be worried about. Back to you in the studio. The detectives spent hours reviewing the evidence. Every lead they had came to a dead end. Who could have done this? Why would they do this? Both questions remain a mystery to the detectives. Police are still investigating the murder of Mr. Newspaper. A source tells us they have no leads and the killer is running free. Police are reminding people not to open their doors to strangers and to be on the lookout for anyone suspicious. Hello? Is this the radio household? Yes. <gasps> We are back on the scene of another brutal murder here in Marketville. Detective, what do we know about this case? Damn it, I don't know what to tell you, but it's definitely another isolated incident. So you don't believe that these two murders are connected at all? In my professional opinion, in our professional opinion, these are definitely not connected. In no way could they possibly ever be connected. Definitely not. <laughs> well. There you have it. There are two possible separate murders on the loose here in Marketville. Stay safe out there, folks. How could this have happened again? The detectives were puzzled by these two cases, both of them leading to dead ends. The people of Marketville were depending on the detectives to protect them with two killers on the loose. <sighs> How did I get so lucky to have a view like this every day? people would kill for a view like this. Would they? We are back at another murder scene here in Marketville. Detective, do we have any new answers? Well, this victim would, was pushed to fell or something from high up place, but that's kind of all we know. Okay, so three of the most predominant families here in Marketville have all been murdered in the past three days. Do we still believe this is an isolated incident? We have reason to believe that. We, there's no evidence that really connects the cases as of right now, and that's all we know. Are you serious? I don't know what to tell you, ma'am. Like, we're doing our best. Okay, well, let's cut back to the studio to our data analysis. Officer, what can you tell us about this? We now have an actual image of the hooded figure. Any suspicions on who it might be? Uh, no comment. I, I don't, I don't, I don't know. this case. Who could be doing this? Loss, take a look at this. Jeepers. <laughs> I 